a bar slides down an inclined plane and the friction is varying as a function of x so as it goes down the friction is increasing so of course it will stop at one time one moment and we need to find what is the distance covered by the particle until it stops and what is the maximum velocity it has attained during that motion so let's write the two forces on the on the bar parallel to the plane so mg sin theta will be downwards and fk sliding friction will be backwards so sliding friction is maximum because it is sliding so that is k times normal reaction mg cos alpha so we have written f is equal to ma here so we have we'll just integrate both sides to find the distance so limits of velocity so it started at zero and stopped also eventually so limits of velocity are zero to zero and displacement is zero to s so we got our distance now what is the maximum velocity so at maximum velocity the dv by dt will be zero because that's a maxima for the vt graph so from first equation if we put acceleration as zero let me just write ac so that you don't get confused between this and the constant a so the acceleration is zero when the velocity is maximum so when we do that here we get the value of x so at x is equal to tan alpha by a acceleration is zero so when x is this what is the velocity so we'll write our second equation again and this time limits of v will be from zero to v max and limits of uh, x will be from zero to this so we do that and we'll find our answer this is the v max